hello, I got a fancy new phone holder, and so now you're all in trouble. Um, I wanted to take a moment to personally and, and sort of visually thank SDPN for their coverage of these Blackhawk situation. Um, I'm not really going to talk about that too much into this, so I will put a disclaimer, but I'm not going to be speaking on that in this moment. Um, it's been really hard as a person who loves this sport to watch what the collateral has been in results of just a terrible mishandling of everything. Um, and it's truly made me question, you know, my involvement with the sport. And I know people have their preconceived notions of what I'm, you know, giving to the game, but this is more than a game to me and it's more than an entertainment or a um distraction from life this is now you know what i hope to do moving forward and with that comes a huge responsibility and it's something that you know i don't take lightly i don't think that anybody does in this position which is why um i think it's important that you know i've tried to stay as educated on the situation as I could, keeping my mental health in mind as well. But um, I just wanted you guys, you all, to know that there are human beings still in this sport. Um, I don't do well with public displays of emotion, um, but I promise you that I am a human being who is trying to make this sport better for the future. Um, I'm trying to make it safer in so many different ways. And for me right now, my focus is more on a you know, disabled fan experience perspective. However, as I get older and as I continue to understand the framework of the sport and how it's been built and maintained in such a horrific way, um, that I want to do my best to do small changes and hopefully bring forth a, a better holistic idea of what the sport means and what we can do to stay as a source of, you know, entertainment and distraction, but that we have the respect and the trust in our players that they will do the right thing, that we have management that will do the right thing, and that, you know, we don't have a bad Apple policy, which is that yeah, we know there's a couple sus people here, but there's so many good ones that it just outweighs it. That's not the mindset we should be going with. We need to remove that from the sport. So this is sort of my commitment to to all of, to you, to hockey Twitter, to hockey fans in general, that I'm going to do my best to do what I can, which includes being mindful of who I support and who I surround myself with and um and that I'm continuing to learn from everybody else as well and that I don't speak for everybody else but that um we know that I'm I'm here with good intention um I'm here to make good changes and it doesn't stop at men's hockey it's for hockey you know across the board um and I'm probably going to have to edit this, so thanks for listening, and um, I'm going to try my best moving forward. And if you follow me and I follow you back and you have suggestions or something that I can do to better myself throughout this process, feel free to send me a DM. I also have my email linked in my bio, which feels like a dangerous thing to promote, but we're just going to let it go. Um... But I, I really do want to make this place better for everybody. And with that being said, um, um, <laughs> we're going to try and keep moving forward. So thank you. And I'll talk to you soon.